What's up guys, Frostblade here, back with another Minecraft video, and today I am going to be showing you how to put data packs into your own Minecraft world. So, I've done lots of videos, a couple of videos like this, like how to put mods into Minecraft, now that I think of it that's the only one that I've done. Um, thinking probably how to put maps into Minecraft for a future video, but yeah. If you haven't already, please make sure to like this video, subscribe if that little subscribe button is still red, and can we try and hit five likes on this video? Um, and please share to all your friends, and once you've done that, then yeah, we're good. Okay, now let's get into the video. So, the first thing that you're going to want to do is go to Google or internet or whatever you use to download your data pack and just download it. So, wait for that download. Okay, it should be downloaded. Now, next thing you want to do is open up your files and go to downloads because assuming that's where downloads from google now you'll see random loot that's what I, that's the data pack i've just downloaded so once you've done that you will want to go into minecraft as you can see i'm in 1.16 not 1.18.1 the reason for this is because that's the version that this data pack is in. So you want to make sure that you go into the version of Minecraft that your data pack is in. Now you will also want to create a well, create the world beforehand. And as you can see, I've already created it. So you need to create it, um, then just exit the world. So next thing you want to do is go to edit. Then you'll see all these different options, but you want to click open world folder. So, as you can see, there is all the different things that this world has. Now, we're only interested in the folder that says data packs, so you want to open that. And you can see it's empty. So what we want to do is grab this, your data pack, and drag it into the data packs folder. Once you've done that, you can just close all of this, then hop back into Minecraft and click save. Once you've done that, everything should be good to go. And you just want to join your world. Once you're in, you should notice that the data pack has started to work. As you can see, the data pack that I chose with random blocks, and as you can also probably see, if I break this sand, it doesn't give me sand. So you can tell that this is working. So that's basically it for this video. And you can click off now if you want, or you can just wait for me to say the random YouTuber stuff that every YouTuber says. And you've probably oh my god, and you've probably heard a million times before. So please make sure to like this video. Subscribe, share it to all your friends, and please turn that notification bell on so you can hear whenever I post a video. And please, please don't be shy to comment down below um, if you 
have any video suggestions that you would like me to do in the future, anything that you need help with on Minecraft or any other game, basically. Yeah, so just name any video that you think. Wow, that you think you would like to see. So, yeah. Um, also, link to my, join my Discord server will be down in the description below. Go check that out, it's a really fun community. Uh, yeah. Yeah, just go check that out. You can always unsubscribe later if you really don't like the videos, but that's fine. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope this helped you out a lot. And, yeah, see you in the next video. Bye.